In this video, we are going to solve a problem on acidity of protons. The question is, the most acidic species among the following. They are given four options. In that, which one will be highly acidic? I am going to explain this on two concepts. The first one, based on aromaticity. Second one, based on conjugate acid. Acidity refers to the ability to donate proton. Among these four, which one can donate proton easily? That will be highly acidic. I go for the second compound. This is the compound. There is plus charge. This is anti-aromatic. You can count the electrons. It will be 4n. There are 4 pi electrons. There is no load pair. It has been used to form bond with hydrogen. So because of that, it is anti-aromatic. So it is highly unstable. Tries to form aromatic compound by losing its proton. If it loses the proton, that is H+, plus, the bond will fall here and what we get is pyrrole. You may know pyrrole, it is aromatic. The number of electrons involved in the delocalization will be 6. 4 will be pi bond electron and one lone pair of electron. Because of that, this proton is readily lost by this species, which means this proton is highly acidic. What about third and fourth? In peridinium ion, the lone pair doesn't involve in delocalization. That lone pair is present in the orbital, which is perpendicular to the pi orbital. So when we go for electron count, we are not considering the lone pair present on the nitrogen. Because of that, even the peridinium ion, it is aromatic. It is not anti-aromatic. Because of that, compared to this, this peridinium ion will be less acidic. For the same reason, this also will be less acidic. What about this? This is pyrrolidine. There is no aromatic property at all since there is no pi bond, no conjugation. There is no aromatic character. So the answer is 2. Anti-aromatic compound becomes aromatic after losing its proton. I go for the second concept that is Conjugate acid. Now to explain this, first I go for OH minus ion. You may know it is base. To this, I add H plus. A bond is formed between them to give water molecule. I go for water molecule itself. If I add H plus to this, the lone pair on oxygen can form bond with H plus. To give this H3O plus, there is one more lone pair here. According to the definition, Base is a species or molecule which abstract the proton. So you can see here OH minus takes proton, water takes proton. So these two are bases.
then the product formed they are known as conjugate acid because the acidic character is more for this this may lose proton to become water molecule now compare this to which will be highly acidic it is very simple very often you might have come across this one H3O plus generally we write acid like this so this is more acidic this one it is less acidic what about the basicity compare OH minus and water you may know this is more basic this is less basic so now compare this if the base is strong base the corresponding conjugate acid will be less acidic if the base is weak then the corresponding conjugate acid will be strong now I am going to apply that concept here that is consider this pyrrole to this I add H plus what is the possibility for this to attack this it is very less because the lone pair is not available to attack this it involves in delocalization to give aromatic character to pyrrole because of that the base city is very 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 less compared to other bases the other bases are pyrrolidine, pyridine and dmap dimethyl aminopyridine compared to them this is less basic that means its conjugate acid will be highly acidic 